What's up, flamethrowers? It is me, Flame the Dragon Hog here, and I'm also joined with... Hello, guys. It's me, Rosie the Rascal here, or Anti-Amy. Yep, I actually decided to bring on somebody for this type of video, which is a best of. You guys know the videos where I look into some of my favorite Sonic tubers and pick out some of the some of my favorite videos. Yeah, and he decided to bring me on because we're actually going to be looking at Scourge the Hedgehog. Yeah, but don't worry. This don't worry. This Scourge is nothing like yours. I promise you. Well, all right. Okay. Well, anyway, for those of you guys who don't know about this version of Scourge, because, just to let you know, guys, I really hate talking about Scourge, but since we're talking about his YouTube, well, since we're talking about a version of his, his uh, channel, it's all good, I guess. But anyway, this version of Scourge is absolutely fun-y. He is so funny. I mean, he's funny, he's awesome, and I'm not going to lie, he's ten times much more better than my Scourge. <laughs> Oh boy, but anyway, let me just tell you guys, I would prefer this version of Scourge other than my version. I mean, he's going to be a father soon, he's going to, he's probably going to be, well, he is already the king of his Moebius, um, or anti-Moebius, whichever one, and not to mention, he's good now. Wait, this version of Scourge is good? Yep, he's actually good. Strange to believe, I know, but yeah, he's actually good. Wow, I would prefer this version of Scourge. Yeah. Anyway, so we're going to be counting down. So we're going to be looking at some of my favorite videos by him. Well, all right. Let's hope they are pretty funny. Yep. Anywho, without further ado, let us begin. Now, if you guys want to see more best of videos, please hit that like button. And let me know in the comments down below which Sonic tuber do you think I would like or want to look at. Oh, and also, special shout-out to Scourge the Hedgehog. You keep up the good work and making us laugh and stuff. Oh, and also, good luck to both you and Speedy Blue, a.k.a. Sonic the Hedgehog, in your uh, <clears throat> little predicament that's happening right now. Uh, but anyway, whew, I'll explain the predicament later, guys. But anyway, without further ado, let us begin. All right, so the first video we have that's by, by by Scourge the Hedgehog that I really like is, well, actually, this isn't, well, it's a short. It doesn't really count as a video, I guess. But anyway, we have <laughs> Fiona doing the uh, ada ada thing to Scourge. And I know what you guys are going to say. The ada ada thing is uh, old now because no, most people do not do that mess again. But it's still funny. I still like it. Yeah, I think it is still pretty funny. Also, um, how did this version of Scourge react? <laughs> like a little baby. He was so weirded out. I mean, can you not? I mean, can we, I mean, can you not? I mean, look at Fiona. She looks, she looks like a whole snack. Well, yeah, I guess. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, uh, also, uh, Scourge, I'm just gonna flat out say this. You are a very, very lucky guy to get with that version of Fiona. She is freaking hot. She's hot. Okay, she's cute, and she's hot. I mean, hello. And I just know that you two are definitely going to be great parents one day. You two are definitely going to be great parents. <laughs> but anyway, yep, that's the video. That This is one of the videos that I like. Oh, and also, guys, just to let you know, this is the first time I ever added a short into a best of video. But anyway, it's still funny. It's still funny. Yeah, I really do think it is still pretty funny. So what's the next video? All right, here we go. It's when Scourge meets Rouge, after so many years later. Oh yeah, I did sort of forgot that Scourge and Rouge actually did team up. Yeah, they actually did team up. Okay, for those of you guys who don't know, in the comics, Scourge and Rouge, they actually did team up. And eventually they did somewhat become a couple. It was pretty weird, but yeah. Anywho, um... Anywho, yeah, you're probably wondering why did they team up? Well, it's because they were both seeking power over the, uh, because they were both looking for, uh, you know, the Master Emerald and the Chaos Emeralds and all that other stuff, and so they just decided to team up. 
and it was just pretty crazy. This happened way, way before, you know, Scourge ever turned green, and before he ever met Fiona in the first place. It was just pretty crazy. Ugh. But anyway, yeah, Rouge and Scourge, they sort of kind of rekindled their, uh, well, not rekindled, they sort of, you know, reminded each other that, you know, both of them were total dicks. <laughs> I mean, Rouge, she pretty much, she just, because, you know, the power of the Chaos Emerald and the Chaos Energy sort of went to scourge his mind and stuff, warped his mind and stuff. It was just pretty insane, and he somewhat betrayed Rouge, and Rouge forever hated him now. It was just insane. Uh, so, yeah, it was just insane. Yeah, I mean, uh Yeah, <laughs> I mean, can you blame her? Yeah, I mean, if I was Rouge and Scourge did that to me, I would 100% dump him easily. Yeah. And hate his guts. Yeah, I know. Anywho, let's see what the next video is. Wait, who's that? That's the anti-version of Blaze. In her, in our world, her name is, F her name is Flame as well. But in their world, her name is Cinder. Cinder? Yep, that's her name, Cinder. But anyway, um, in this video, her and Scourge actually played Sonic World. And they actually got along pretty well. Uh, oh yeah, for those of you guys who don't know who uh, Cinder is, Cinder, like I said, she's the anti-version of Blaze. And she's also... <laughs> she's also uh, Scourge's maid in his castle. Wow, that's definitely something. Yep, she's actually Scourge's maid, and it's actually pretty funny. I mean, I have never seen a yellow blaze before until I met, you know, Flame the Cat from my anti-universe. It was definitely pretty interesting. But anyway, they did actually get along pretty well when they played Sonic World. They actually did. It's actually really nice and it's still cool. Um... So, yeah, they actually get along. I mean, don't get me wrong, guys. Sonic World is a really interesting Sonic game. A fan-made Sonic game. I mean, they should make it into an actual Sonic game, guys. They should actually make it. I mean, the fan games and stuff, when it comes to Sonic, it's actually pretty interesting. Like, they make, game, like, they make the fan games almost similar to the normal games, which is just amazing. And also, great job to, uh, you know, Scourge and whoever voice Cinder. You guys did a great job playing this game. And I'm actually glad that, you know, Cinder is doing a great job helping you out, Scourge, when it comes to, you know, your every need and stuff. It's actually pretty good. Anyway, moving on to the next video. And this was when <laughs> they first encount encountered each other. Well, this is when they uh, encountered each other. Hmm. Well, don't you mean confront? Yeah, it, yeah, this is when they uh, confront each other. It was definitely really interesting. Um, I really don't know much about this video because, uh, to tell you the truth, guys, like I said before, I am not that much of a big Scourge the Hedgehog fan, but I am a uh, big fan of this version of Scourge. But I haven't exactly gotten around to this video, but I have seen clips of it. I have seen clips, uh, a little bit parts of it, and I'm not going to lie, it's pretty interesting. I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty interesting. It's pretty interesting, and that's all I'm gonna say. Uh, Scourge, please do not hate me in the comments for, you know, knowing so little about this video. I'm sorry, okay? I'm really, really sorry. <sighs> Anywho, um, so yeah, that's basically that video. It's really interesting. Uh, what do you think, Rosie? Well, it is something. I mean... Let's just hope that they didn't actually, you know, do the, uh, situation, you know? Don't worry, they didn't, they didn't, they didn't. It's just weird. But anyway, let's move on to the next one. Ah, some more Would You Rather. Well, some Would You Rather. Yep, we have Scourge and Fiona playing Would You Rather. And, <laughs> let me just say, they actually did get along pretty well. I'm not gonna lie, they actually did get along pretty well. They did have some interesting answers to the questions and stuff, but, uh, yeah, it was definitely something. <laughs> Scourge, what to do with you, man? Uh, but anyway, uh, yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong. Fiona, she is really, uh, cute and stuff, this, this model of her. Scourge, do not hate me. I mean, please, come on. 
How could you not look at this version of Fiona and say she's not cute? I mean, come on, think about it. But anyway, um, yeah, they actually did get along pretty well. Like I said before, they actually did get along pretty well. And not to mention, and not to mention, you know, they did have a lot of fun playing Would You Rather. I mean, Would You Rather is a fun game. Yeah, it is a really fun game. You know, I ought to bring on one of you guys to play Would You Rather again. Really? Yeah, I enjoy playing Would You Rather with you girls. Hmm, I just don't know what to play. I just don't know. Uh, hmm. I really don't know. But anyway, uh, so yeah, I really do enjoy this video right here. It was actually really good. It was really funny. Like I said before, interesting answers to the questions. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so keep up the good work, guys. Anyway, let's keep her going. Oh boy, this video. What is this? Uh, basically, they were, uh, basically this video was about, uh, <sighs> Scourge and Fiona, you know, res you know, uh, recapping on what their marriage was like. What their marriage was like. And not to mention featuring Sonic, because Sonic was the one that married them in the first place. What? I thought Sonic hated Scourge. Um... This happened after Scourge became good. This happened after Scourge became good and turned his life around and stuff. It was just really insane. So, um, yeah, um, basically what happened was, was, uh, yeah, like I said, they were actually just re-electing their wedding and how well they, and how well they got along. And since Sonic was there, Scourge was actually talking about how much they beat each other up. Oh, yeah. Scourge and Sonic, they actually did beat each other up a lot. Yeah, to see who's the more superior Sonic. Yeah, the good or the evil. <laughs> yeah. Well, if you ask me, I say the good version is a whole lot better. I mean, Scourge got his ass kicked a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, like most villains, they do often get their asses kicked. But anywho, yeah, I really did like this video. It was somewhat cute. It was somewhat cute. <clears throat> Excuse me. But anyway, it was somewhat cute. Scourge and Fiona, like I said before, well, this version, they do make a really nice couple and stuff. And I know for a fact that Scourge and Fiona, they're going to look out for each other for a long, 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 long time. Okay, okay, that's enough longs. Okay, sorry. I just love this version of them so much. It's too funny. Okay, anyway, and yeah, Scur yeah, and like I said, Sonic was the one that married them. And again, I thought they hated each other. They, and like I said before, this happened after Scourge became good. Well, alright. Yeah, it's definitely something. I mean, even Sonic was surprised. Sonic was surprised. <sighs> anyway, let's move on to the next one. Oh, okay. Now, the, okay, the thumbnail is a little bit blurry, guys, but I'm pretty sure you guys can make out on what the heck this is. Uh, we have Scourge and Sonic introducing Fiona and Tails after so many years. Because, you see, guys, we all, the, cause we all know the most tragic event that happened between, between Fiona and Tails. I mean, Tails, he really did like Fiona a whole lot. Like, a whole lot. And then, next thing you know... His honor or his feelings was really hurt when Fiona started playing with his feelings and then he, then she, uh, smacked him across the face and smacked him across the face. Ugh, that was just really messed up. Yeah, I have heard about that. Poor Tails. Yeah, poor Tails. And they were somewhat trying to, you know, rekindle their friendship. It was really hard for them because, you know... Because every time, because every time Tails always looked at Fiona, he always started, you know, playing that scene back in his head over and over and over and over again. Man, I mean, can you blame him? The one person that he liked the most smacked him across the face. Yeah, and he put out his heart and soul into it. Yeah, that was just really harsh. Yeah. But, you know, it would have been kind of great if there was a timeline where he and Fiona actually did get together. I wonder if there is. 
you know, I do dimension hop a lot. Maybe there might be a dimension where skirt where um Tails' words actually did get to Fiona and yeah, Fiona stayed with the Freedom Fighters. I wonder if there is that. Hmm, maybe. Who knows? Well, well, uh, yeah. It was a little bit awkward seeing them interact with each other, especially after so long. It was just harsh. Oh, and by the way, guys, just to let you know, <laughs> believe it or not, Fiona, she actually wore her old orange and white jumpsuit instead of her black outfit. Instead of her black outfit, she wore her old orange and white suit. It was just something, <laughs> a little callback from the past. But anyway, yeah, this video was interesting. Anyway, moving on to the next one. Oh man, what the heck happened here? This was when Scourge first meets Movie Sonic. This was when Scourge first meets Movie Sonic. That was definitely funny. I mean, they both really did not get along. Yeesh. And I also heard that Movie Sonic, he was actually, he's supposed to be nice. Yeah, he is nice, but <laughs> we just don't want to piss him off too much. I mean, sure, Scourge has never met Movie Sonic, but it was definitely something. I'm not going to lie, that was definitely something. A weird interactment, but uh, <laughs> yeah, it was definitely interesting. Yeah, and I can also see that Fiona was there too. Yeah, she stayed out of it. She stayed out of it. Like, she was like, hey, you two morons, just fight, okay? Just leave me out of this. <laughs> well, that was definitely funny. That seems funny. It is funny. I mean, come on. How could you not look at this and say that it was funny? I mean, it brings back old times. You know, when Scourge and Sonic actually fought. Yeah, but this time, it's Scourge and Movie Sonic. Yeah. <laughs> It was definitely pretty funny. Okay, anyway, uh, let's see what the next video was. Oh, yeah, this is the situation I was talking about way in the beginning of the video, guys. You see, it's a current event that's happening right now, guys. Uh, and we can definitely see parts of it over on Speedy Blue's channel, aka Sonic. Um, see, what happened was, was that, uh... Scourge and Sonic, they met with the Zone Cops, and the Zone Cops arrested both Scourge and Sonic for something that they didn't do. It, but right now, they're still trying to, you know, figure a way out of Zone Jail. <laughs> with a little bit of help from uh, inmates in the Zone Jail, or should I say, like, allies in the Zone Jail and stuff. It was just crazy. <laughs> Especially from one hedgehog. Her name is Mayhem. She's supposed to be the anti version of uh, another hedgehog. It was uh, definitely something. And let me just tell you what she had to do to uh, get some information out of the zone cops was pretty weird. But hey, when you're in zone jail, anything goes. Ugh. But anyway, like I said before, what happened was with that Scourge and Sonic, they were both arrested for something that they were falsely accused of doing, it was just horrible. I'm not gonna lie, it was just horrible. So, yeah, so right now, so so right now Sonic and Scourge, they're in zone jail. They're right now in zone jail, uh, you know, working off their sentence, and they're really, really trying to get the heck out of the zone jail. They really are trying. But let me just tell you, spoilers for those of you guys who have not seen the video yesterday spoiler alert alina fiona and amy were not happy same thing with jules aka sonic's dad they were not happy at all about scourge and sonic being locked up in jail for something that they didn't do i mean wouldn't you guys be i mean wouldn't you guys be angry about it if somebody you know didn't do anything and they ended up getting locked up in jail yeah, I would definitely be upset. Yeah, it was definitely, yeah, it was definitely something. Everybody was angry. And let me just tell you, Zone Cops, you guys are not like the Zone Cops in my world because they really know how to do their job. They know how to do their job. You guys, uh, I don't know. But anyway, let's just move on to the next video and stop before, you know, 
I spoil anything else because I really don't want to. Because <laughs> I'm right now waiting for part four to come out of the uh, Zone Cop arc. And I'm pretty sure Speedy Blue is actually working really, really hard on it. So, yeah. Anyway, let's keep the ball rolling. Okay, so next up we have is Scourge meeting Classic Sonic. Oh, man. That was definitely... That's definitely something. Yeah. <laughs> in a way... Yeah, that's definitely, in a way, something. Uh, see, basically what happened was, was that Classic Sonic, he actually, um... Because, you see, Classic Sonic, he was just telling Modern Sonic about a certain event that happened in his world uh, involving a green hedgehog. Involving a green hedgehog. And, uh, what happened was, was that, uh... Classic Sonic found out it was Scourge, and let's just say some awkwardness happened. Yeah, I, yeah, some awkward stuff happened. It's just crazy. Yikes, what happened? Uh, name calling, arguing, and lots of things. Sonic, he really did try to calm both of them down, though. Yeesh, because do not piss off Scourge. I mean, he'll go back to being evil. Well, oh, this version. We really, we really don't want that. We don't want that. Yeah, but anyway, it was definitely something. Uh, but anyway, it was definitely something. It was definitely a really funny video. I'm not going to lie, it was a really funny one. Just seeing them fight. I don't know what it is about these two. I don't know what it is about Classic Sonic and Scourge. And, or sometimes the other versions fight. I don't know what it is, but <laughs> there's a whole bunch of name calling and stuff. And it's just too funny. I'm sorry. It was just too funny. Okay, well, anyway, let's keep the ball rolling with the next video. <laughs> oh, man, I remember this one. What? What is it? And, wait, is that supposed to be Scourge? Why is he blue again? Well, basically, this is what happened. You see... While Scourge, he was at a Burger King, he was at a Burger King where he met, where he met, uh, uh, Shadina, where he met Shadina. And those two, they weren't really getting along, they weren't actually getting along pretty well because of, uh, what happened with Rosie, and I'm gonna, you know, say that for another time, but yeah, anyway, uh, see, what happened was, is that due to a certain event... I don't know what happened. Scourge, he went back to being blue. He turned blue again. You know, with, you know, the way he looked before he turned green. Yeah. Yeah, and it was pretty funny. See, what happened was, was that, uh, Shadina thought it was modern Sonic and started chasing him all over the mall. Yikes. That probably brought back memories. Yeah, it did. Especially when, you know... Especially when uh, <laughs> Shadina was just getting over Modern Sonic. He was, she was just getting over Modern Sonic and going after Boom Sonic. Yikes. Yeah. And just to let you know, may you rest in peace, Boom Sonic. I'm sorry. May you rest in peace. But anyway, uh, it was definitely something. It was definitely crazy. It was definitely really funny, too, just seeing old times roll again. Just, you know, Shadina chasing after Sonics, and, uh, <laughs> it was just really funny. Yeah, I bet it was pretty funny. It was. It was definitely really funny. And, but luckily, Scourge managed to change back to green. He turned back to green. It was okay. Well, alright. Well, at least we are. At least he's, he's, at least he's green again. Yeah. Whew. I mean, can you imagine what will happen if Fiona found out if, you know, that was him? Yeah, that would have been really weird. Yeah, obviously. But anyway, let's keep the ball rolling. Oh boy, I really enjoyed this video. This was when Scourge first meets female Sonic, otherwise known as Sonica. Oh, that was definitely, that must have been interesting. Yeah, knowing that there's a female version of Sonic out there. <laughs> Let me just tell you, Scourge, he definitely was, uh, you know, really amazed. Scourge was really amazed at this. It was really something. <laughs> so, um, anyway, what they did was they actually raced go-karts. It was, uh, pretty weird. Copyright a little bit from Mario Kart, but they did actually have a lot of fun, you know, just racing and all sorts of stuff. They did have a lot of fun. Yeah, they did, actually. <laughs> yeah, 
it was actually pretty fun. It was actually really cool seeing all three of them actually get along pretty well. Because, hey, they're all Sonics, in a way. They're all Sonics. So, of course, they would actually get along pretty well. Anyway, let's keep the ball rolling with the next video. Oh, God. Okay. Now, this video was definitely awesome. It was the final part of the Fleetway arc. The Fleetway arc? I don't remember that one. Basically, what happened was, was that when some, basically what happened was, was that, okay, long story short, Sonic let his Fleetway, Fleetway form out way, way too much to the point where he finally corrupted his body. And he actually got together with Rosie after, you know, Rosie got her heart broken and they started, you know, forming a relationship of crazy people. And basically what happened was, was that Fleetway, he wanted to, um, destroy all the world in the blazing inferno and infect all the different sonics in the world turning them into fleetways i mean he already afflicted multi he already afflicted fleetway he already afflict uh multiverse fleetway he affected brandy he affected boom sonic and he affected sonica he affected scourge and lots of other different versions uh, but luckily both but luckily boom multi and scourge they all teamed up to take him down Thank God. And also, and also they arrested Rosie. Well, that's good to know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that version of me, ugh. Yeah, it was definitely really crazy, ugh. But, <laughs> believe it or not, believe it or not, uh, I'm gonna save that for another video. I don't know what the heck happened. But let's just say Rosie got out of zone jail. Yeesh, darn it. Yeah. But, anywho, um... Anywho, yeah, the zone, but let me just tell you guys, that was actually really, really great. I'm not going to lie. The, sorry, the, um, the Fleetway Sonic arc was definitely one of the most craziest and the most dangerous uh, and one of the most action-packed videos I have ever seen by Speedy Blue. He is definitely awesome. And same thing with uh, multi, same thing with multi, boom, and of course, scourge. It was just crazy. But anyway, let me just say, they actually did do a really great job with the Fleetway arc. Sorry that it's over, but it's okay. We can always just go back and look at the videos. <laughs> yeah, I ought to look at those videos. This, it seems like, it seems really fun. Yeah, but uh, it's not going to be fun when you find out what the heck happened to, uh, Fiona in the process. Yikes. Yeah, and Shadina. Yeesh. And all the other Boom characters. Ugh. Yeah, they basically ended up getting injured thanks to the Fleetways. Ugh. I feel so bad for them. Yeah. But anyway, let's keep the ball rolling. Anyway, let's keep the ball rolling. Ah, uh, now this video was definitely awesome. See, what happened, see, this video was definitely really cute. It was when Scourge first meets Queen Alina. When he, when he first meets Queen Alina, that video, this video was absolutely adorable. And you see, Scourge started feeling a little bit awkward after when he found out that was Sonic's mom. And, uh, <laughs> he actually did get a little bit weirded out because, uh... He actually did get a little bit weirded out because um, he never met his mom because Scourge never met his mom. Yeah, because Scourge never met his mom. It was definitely uh, awkward for him. But, he, but Queen Alina, as the nice person that she is, she actually decided to uh, treat, treat um, Scourge as, his, as her own son. In a way, it was actually really cool. It was actually really nice of her, too. I mean, she was so nice. I mean, she invited him over to dinner, she pressed his jacket, and she even let him call, and she even let him call her mom, and lots of things. It was just really adorable. It was so cute. It was cute. It was just really cute. Yeah, mm, to think, Scourge actually had a soft side. Yeah. Yeah, it was really cute. However, it was definitely really insane, though. 
However, it was really, really insane, though. <laughs> they actually did get along pretty well. <laughs> but, you know... Phew! <coughs> excuse me, sorry. But anyway, now that I think about it, in a way, Sonic and Scourge, they're almost like brothers, in a way. Even though, you know, they're different versions of Sonic's. But, <laughs> it's definitely really cool, though, seeing them all together and stuff. It was just really cool, just spending time together. It was actually really nice. Nice, happy family. With two Sonics. Eh, it was really, uh, weird, but okay. Anywho, let's move on to the next video. Ah, now this one was really interesting. This was when Fiona and Scourge actually went out on a date. Well, a second date. Well, I couldn't find the first date. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I couldn't find the first date, but I did find the second date, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you okay, Rosie? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I mean, don't get me wrong. If only it was me. It's okay. It's okay. I mean, you're with me now. I mean, if you want, we can go out later tonight. You really mean it? Of course. Aw, that's sweet. <laughs> anyway, uh, back to the video. Scourge and Fiona, they actually did spend a lot of time together out on the uh, on their second date. And I believe, I don't remember if this is the part where, you know, he asked Fiona to marry him. I do not remember if it is. They might have got married off screen because we never actually saw their wedding. But I'm not going to lie. I get so emotional when it comes to, you know, Sonic couples going on, on dates. I mean, this is cool. Sonic and Amy, cool. Uh, excuse me. Knuckles and Rouge, cool. Uh, Silver and Blaze, cool. Tails and Cream. Yeah, it was definitely really cool. Uh, sorry about the Tails and Sonic Pals version of Cream and stuff. Sorry. But anywho, I, again, I really do get emotional when I see Sonic couples, you know, just spend some time together and just basically, you know, just rekindle their love for each other. And sure, and sure, Scourge and Fiona's, Eve, sure, sure, Scourge and Fiona's, um, love is based off of evil. Well, it used to be, but not anymore. But it was definitely something. But anyway, yeah, I really did enjoy this video. It was so cute and adorable. Yeah, I bet it was. Yeah, it was. Anyway, let's move on to the next one. Oh, oh wait, this is the first date. Sorry, guys. I found the first date. I forgot I, I put it on this list. I'm sorry. Anyway, yep, this was the first date that they ever went on after many, many months of, uh, you know, just being together. I totally forgot what happened in here. But I just wanted to include this in this video. I mean, come on, everybody think about it. The first date is definitely the special date when it comes to couples, obviously. I mean, come on, guys, think about it. I'm pretty sure there's lots of people out there who still rekindle their uh, first date with their mate, obviously. I mean, come on. I mean, come on. Name one person out here who doesn't remember their very first date with the, when it comes to their uh, boyfriend or girlfriend. I mean, come on, don't be ashamed. But anyway, um... But anyway, yeah, this was just actually really cool and stuff. It was really nice and sweet. <laughs> Again, it was sure was nice to see a different side of Scourge, you know, being all nice and sweet and kind, other than ruthless and tough. It was just insane. <sighs> Anywho, moving on to the next video. Oh, hey, I, hey, cool, I'm in this one. Oh, yeah, I remember this video, um... Uh, it was, uh, something. Why? What's wrong? What happened? You don't look so good. Uh, if only you knew what the heck happened in this video. Well, see, basically what happened was, was that Scourge and Fiona, they were out on a date when all of a sudden an annoying pink hedgehog decided to crash their date. Let me guess. I was the annoying pink hedgehog? Yeah. See, basically what happened... See, basically what happened was, was that you were steady trying to get Scourge to dump Fiona, to dump Fiona and go with her. And go with, uh, you know, that version of Rosie. And, uh, she was like, I really miss the old times, you know, us being evil, taking over the worlds and stuff. Like, she really, really missed the old times that they had together. 
Yeah, but those ta yep, but those days are over. Yeah. In fact, she really, really doesn't want that to be she really didn't want it to be over. In fact, <laughs> all her life she just wanted Scourge. But nope. She ended up with Fiona he ended up with Fiona. It was definitely something. But anywho, um and sh let me just tell you something else. Scourge got so mad that he immediately went dark form. He immediately went dark form and, you know, practically yelled at this version of Rosie. Aw, poor other version of me. I bet she was really heartbroken. Yeah, and that's one of the reasons why Shadina hates Scourge in the first place. Because of this right here. The way he treated her. Aw, well, if I was Shadina, I would definitely be mad at her. I would definitely be mad at him because of that, too. Yep, that's pretty much what happened. Whew, it was definitely insane, but... Excuse me. It was definitely insane, and that's, and because of what he did, and because of what he did, he, uh, ended up causing her to, uh, you know, be with Fleetway. Oh my god. But anyway, um, it was definitely crazy, not gonna lie. It was definitely insane. But anywho, uh, yeah, this video was definitely bad. I mean... I left Scourge a comment here saying that he was the worst. Okay, see, so look, guys, I'm just going to flat out say this. This was when he was, you know, back in the day, evil. This was when he was evil, okay? I really hated Scourge. I'm not going to lie. I, I'm, I'm personally going to, I'm honestly going to say this. I honestly did hate Scourge for the way he treated, the way he treated Rosie. I even left that, I even left a nasty comment in there. And, Scourge, if you want, I'm more than happy to delete that. I'm more than happy to, if you want me to. Because, hey, I didn't mean anything by it, okay? I just get so, I just get so upset and emotional about, you know, how, how people mainly, how people, you know, treat other people. I get really upset because of that. So, yeah, that's why I, uh, did that to you. So, I am really, really sorry. I really am sorry. So, Scourge, if you want, I can take down the video. I could take down the comment, okay? I could take down the comment. But anyway, yeah, I am really, really sorry I did leave that comment. And I'm more than likely gonna take I'm pretty sure I'll take it down, okay? If I can find the video, alright? Anywho, anywho, I'm not gonna lie, this video was really interesting. It did hurt me to see the way you did treat uh Rosie, but she did somewhat have it coming, I guess. I don't know. Aw. Uh, well, I guess. Even though we are sort of talking about me. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not talking about you, Rosie. We're talking about a different Rosie. I promise. Anywho, um, let's just move on to the next video before I start bursting out in tears. Yeah, me too. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, so here we go. This was... This video was really interesting it's when uh excuse me scourge meets the anti version of rouge meets the anti version of rouge i forgot her name and it was definitely something it was definitely something she was being interviewed and believe it or not she actually got a job being a second maid and being a guard for scourge it was actually really interesting not gonna lie and Plus, not to mention seeing an anti version of seeing an anti version of Rouge. I'm just gonna say <whistles> that's definitely something. An anti version of Rouge. <laughs> yeah, let's just hope that she's anything like the normal version of Rouge. She probably isn't. I mean, hello. Think about it. Evil anti. I guess, but it's cool. I guess, but anyway. <laughs> Let's keep the ball rolling with these, uh, let's keep the ball rolling with this, uh, video. Let's keep the ball rolling, alright? Alright, let's see what we got next. Oh, okay, and next up we have is, uh, Scourge meeting Scourgina. Well, in Moebius. <laughs> because he did meet her before, but not in Moebius. You see, what happened was, was that she actually confused his world for her world. And, uh, <laughs> she tried taking over the place. 
What the world, female scourge? Yep, that's basically what happened. It was definitely insane and funny. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, it was definitely funny. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, just seeing both of them just arguing about who's the rifle ruler of that Moebius, it was definitely really funny. It was just really funny. I'm sorry, Scourge, but I know you were basically fighting for your, uh, you know, your, uh, thing. It was definitely really funny. I'm not gonna lie, that is definitely pretty funny. Yeah, it does seem pretty funny. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Anywho, yeah, so I wonder what the female Scourge is actually up to anyway. Well, I know our version is actually just sitting back chilling. Yeah, yeah, she is sitting back chilling, isn't she? Yeah. You know, how about we make it a double date? A double date? Yeah, I, yeah, I could take both of you out, and I don't think you two actually met each other yet. No, I don't think we have. Well, I'll be more than happy to take both of you out tonight. Great. <laughs> Anywho, um, yeah, the female version of Scourge was definitely interesting and weird. So, uh, yeah, it was definitely something. Anyway, let's move on to the next video. Oh, God, okay, now this one was definitely weird. This one was definitely weird. Okay, see, what happened was, was that, uh, Scourge actually, uh, was, you know, just chilling out with Sonic then next thing you know, well, not really chilling out with Sonic. He uh, just walked into a pizza hut where Sonic was actually working. Don't ask. And uh, <laughs> he uh, met up with uh, Shadina. And Shadina was once again flirting with Sonic. And and he was, and she was really, really mad at Scourge for what he did to uh, Rosie and everything. It was just insane. And uh, yeah, she... Chucked his pizza, ate his pizza, and lots of things. Uh, it was just crazy. It was just too weird. I might have to watch this video after when I make this, guys. I might have to watch this. It's just so weird. But anyway, yeah, this is basically what happened. And uh, it's uh, something, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, let's keep the ball rolling. Oh, this was the last video. Sorry. Ah. Yeah, anyway, I guess this version of Scourge isn't so bad. Yeah, but our version of Scourge is 100% evil. Yeah, I don't think there's no trace of goodness in his body at all. Nope, there isn't. But, because of me, I managed to draw out some of the goodness in your bodies. Yeah, I did. Yeah, you did, didn't you? Mm-hmm. Well, I guess I might as well go get ready for tonight. Yeah, and also, tell Breach, also, uh... Tell Breach that she should get ready, too. All right. I guess I'll see you later, Flamey. Aw, that's sweet of you. Aw, that's sweet of you. Now go on somewhere. All right. Bye. Bye. Whew. Well, guys, I guess that's it for this best of video. Now, before I sign off, I just got to say one thing. <clears throat> Scourge the Hedgehog. <laughs> You sure did come a long way from being evil to, you know, being one of the good guys. And it did take me a while to actually like you because, to tell you the truth, I always had a problem with Scourge. I always had a problem with Scourge the Hedgehog because, you know, out of all the evil versions of Sonic, and yes, there are multiple different versions of evil Sonics, you're definitely the worst. You're definitely the worst. It did take me a while to finally get used to you, especially after when you became a good guy. I thought it was going to be a trick, but nope, you actually came through, helped out everybody, and you decided to become a good guy. So, I'm not going to lie, you finally earned, you earned my respect back. You earned my respect back. And I just got to say, keep up the good work with the videos, keep it up, continue to make us laugh, and, you know, make us feel things just like how you did with me and that <clears throat> rosy video but anyway just keep up the good work and also um if you like maybe one of these days we could do a collab i hope one of these days we can because i because that's just one of my dreams that's just my that's just my major dream it's to uh collab with one of you guys like like multiverse sonic you speedy blue uh t varia sailor peace Shadow the Hedgehog, Silver the Hedgehog, and lots of others. 
I just want, I really do hopefully one of these days will do a collab with you guys, but I'm not a recognizable YouTuber. I'm really not, but I just got to keep rising up and yeah, but anyway, Scourge, like I said before, just keep up the good work and posting videos. I know you haven't been posting videos that much. Same thing with Fiona, but it's okay. We are still waiting and we are really good at being patient. I mean, we have to. It's not like it's not like us rushing you is gonna post any faster. But anyway, um, so yeah. And if you guys want to check out any of these videos that I talked about, I will put Scourge's video. I will put Scourge's channel down in the description below, so that way you guys can go on and check them out without me talking. And come back and and let me know in the comments. How did you guys like them? How did you guys like the videos? Like, were they touching enough or something, I guess? I don't know, but yeah. Anywho, that's it for this best of video. I do apologize for not doing them for a while. It's just a while, it just takes a while to, you know, think of a Sonic channel. Cause you know, there's lots, cause you know, some of my favorite Sonic channels, they, have a, they haven't been posting for a long while and it's just so hard. But anyway, but anyway, that's it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please leave a like and comment down below. And if you guys are not already subscribed to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. So that way you guys will be up to date whenever I post. And again, Scourge, I really am sorry for the comment that I left for you in that one video. I do apologize, but I'm more than willing to take it down if you want me to. Anywho, anywho, flame, anywho, this is Flame the Dragon Hog signing out for now. Later, flamethrowers.